This experiment is called Get In Touch. And it's all about our skin and our sense of touch. Really simple, all we need is some cocktail sticks and some sticky tape, uh, a ruler marked with millimetres and uh, some scissors and uh, a pencil. And you also need some pieces of card that are about the same size as a credit card. Um, and you'll find all the measurements you need uh, for this experiment in the Messy Church Does Science book under the Get In Touch experiment. What we're making is a little gadget to measure how sensitive your skin is. And here's one that, uh, that somebody's already made. As you can see, it's got prongs around it that have been sellotaped onto the card. So we've got one prong at the top here, and then we've got two prongs that are quite close together. We've got another two prongs a little bit further apart, and two prongs that are quite a long way apart. In fact, those are 15 millimetres apart. And this is a version of a tool that real doctors use to test the sensitivity of skin of their patients. So I'm going to test the sensitivity of Jane's skin now and see whether she can feel the difference between what might be, is it one prong or is it two prongs on her different parts of her skin? So are you ready, Jane? Yes. All right, here we go. Could you hold out your arm for me? Brilliant. Now then, here we go. First of all, I'm going to ask you to close your eyes. Brilliant. And then I'm going to touch you. It might be with one prong, it might be with two prongs. But if you can just tell me how many prongs you can feel on the back of your hand, all right? I'm not going to dig in so that it actually makes a hole in Jane's hand, you will see, but actually just touch her quite gently with perhaps one prong, perhaps two. Here we go. Uh, can you feel one prong or two, Jane? Two prongs. <sighs> Very good, it was indeed two prongs. Now, uh, I might be moving it around a bit. Um, I'm now going to touch on the back of your arm. Can you tell me if you can feel one prong or two prongs? One prong. <gasps> Open your eyes, how amazing, because what I did was I used the same distance prongs, both on the back of your hand and on your arm. And on the back of your hand, you could feel that there were two prongs, but on the back of your arm, you only felt one. So the sensitivity was very different in different parts. What an amazing organ the skin is, how you can feel different things on different parts of your body. And what you can do is to try out this experiment very carefully without poking anyone's eye out on different parts of your friend or your mum or dad or granny um, and see where, where they can feel one prong or two prongs, maybe on legs or toes or the sole of your foot or your elbow or the back of your ear, things like that. So have a go at finding out what your sense of touch is like in different parts of your body. And touch is an amazing thing. Jesus came to earth as a human being with skin like ours. And do you remember that story when somebody came to him who nobody else would touch? He was untouchable. He had a, a, a really sad disease that meant he was totally cut off from the rest of society. And he came to Jesus and he said, Lord, if you want to, you can make me well. And Jesus was filled with compassion. He had that feeling in his stomach that this was not how things should be. He really, really cared for the man. And he reached out and he touched the man. And he said, I do want to. Now you are well. And straight away, the man's disease left him and he was well again. What an amazing power touch can have. What an amazing Jesus we have.